You ever play full support, Medivh? I don't think... I don't think so. Maybe we can give it a try next run as a GM. How does this even work on quick cast? Just press once, 2E, 2E. Eh, it should work for you. Good luck. Well, they do have one Zul'jin at least. Could be worse, I suppose. I like going that build too, their Angelord. I do that in Bronze GM pretty often. I was just going for the Zul'jin to try to make him cancel his TP. It looks like he cancelled it anyways. Fine for me. Fine with me. Thought Diablo was going to go bottom. He is chilling. Maybe I'll go bottom then. I'll make sure he doesn't die if he's going. These actually feel pretty good on my team, it's not bad. I mean, it's a straight line skill shot, you don't really need to aim much. Quick cast W. Oh, I might misclick. Yeah, I'll try to be careful about that. You're right. That could be weird. This Lily is not aware of the power of Lemdiv. You're normally unkillable, but not a form with a four-man Raven portal. You're pretty killable still. She did that a little sooner. If I knew he was gonna heal me, I could keep chasing and get the kill. Isn't splendid? 
You ever play Medivh offlane? I'm trying to win? No. Like, maybe there's like a 1% chance on a two lane map where you don't need a wave clear at all. And you really need to protect, but that's 99% of the time? No. Uh, none of us are standing next to Brightwing. This fight is way too disjointed. Very awkward. We'll just give this. Protect is protecting so much, actually. Can't kill him without a wall stun, no. really not sure that my Diablo will time Leyline Apoc properly, you know? I kind of feel like he won't. So... Let's just go Polyball. Yeah, the enemy team doesn't seem like they play against Medivh. All their calculations are okay if there's no Medivh. But they're not anticipating the portals at all. Was in range. Yeah, whatever, it's fine. Oh, I actually got him. The explosion did so much damage there because it was absorbing both tower shots. 50% of damage absorption plus the uh, base damage. It's big. I'm just killing them with the explosion from infinite tower shots. Oh, cool. That guy got exploded too. Everyone's getting exploded, dude. 139 plus up to 546. So it could do like 700 AoE explosion damage. It's pretty good. There's 
my precious seed. Go and get right into Mediv. Yeah, right into Mediv is not great, especially if he's going full W build into a Mediv. Tormented full W is actually better. That's true. Not even a single team death. Well, that's what Mediv Brightwing does. <laughs> The whole point of Medivh Brightwing is your team better not be dying, you know? If they're dying, it's doomed. At least if you're ahead, like we are. If you're ahead with a Medivh Brightwing, nothing dies. Ah, oh, shit. I messed up. Oh, but Brightwing didn't. You can do what he just did there. You can always wait it out, and if your team forces protect first, then you can last rights after. Leo is DR. <laughs> Portal instead of hex reduction? Well, Cooldown reduction is not very good with Hex because it's percentage cooldown reduction. So, 10% of 40... It's okay, I mean it's not bad. You know, it's a lot less than 10% of uh, 80. So you're only getting half value if you're CDRing Polybomb versus Leyline. You can still do it if you want more. If you really want more ults. I'm actually kind of thinking I should have gone the damage talent. Damage talent would be better. I'm not even using my ult, so I don't really need my ult much, honestly. Forever, not like this. <laughs> One death, unlucky. So close to no deaths. Medivh diff? Yeah, kinda. Kinda was. I prefer this version of Garden or the old one. I don't like either version of Garden. I just don't like Garden that much. Yeah, it's too big, too many camps. The proper way to play is like uh, doing the camps, which your team like usually doesn't do. And so, usually when I play Garden, my team just never does the right thing. And also doing 